Alright, welcome back. After we made our daring escape from that plate fall, which we somehow survived, uh, Cloud and Tifa will join your party as you try to run back to Eris' house. But before we do that, head back into the playground and we can find a sense materia. Which I won't really be using, it's kind of like Scan or Libra and the other Final Fantasy games. Uh, but, uh, just head back to Eris's house place. Uh, but first you can, if you did this before, head into this, uh, kind of doorway on the right, and if you remember this kid, we left his five gill. And for leaving his 5 gill, he saved up money and bought a turbo ether for us. Or, well, not for us, but he bought one and gave it to us. I don't know why he was saving up his money just to give it to us. We're probably just going to sell it anyway for more than 5 gill. So after that conversation there, just head upstairs and run into Barrett and Marlini and then run outside. Uh, there is a kind of option thing to pick there. If you want to date Eris, say, I don't know, and if you don't want to date Eris later on, pick the first option, which I don't know what it was, but the option opposite of I don't know. Yeah, pick that one. So head back to the wall market. Uh, should be hard to find, just backtrack back to the playground and run through there. And we need to find three better batteries before we continue on. So go into the weapon shop here. Don't talk to the shop uh, keeper or owner, the guy that's selling stuff. Instead, talk to the guy on the left and he'll sell you three batteries for 300 gil. So buy those and follow these kids into the next section. But if you missed the item in here, if you got Cloud picked and you followed my advice in the previous video and got the silk dress, which I didn't get, I got a cotton dress, you can get Phoenix down from that item on the right, or room on the right. And you can also free this guy who's chained up, I think Tifa maybe chained him up down here. So we're just going to free him because we're good guys, we're good Samaritans. Let him loose and leave Corneo's mansion or hut, house, whatever you want to call it. And head to the right where those kids left. And you're gonna climb up this pipe here. So, this is gonna take a while. But, uh... Everyone should be equipped from the last s boss battle section with Reno. And if you click select, I don't know, I believe I mentioned this on the first video, but if you click select you can see red arrows which tells you where exits in certain areas are. So head down here to the right and put this first battery in and you'll see this propeller start to spin. Now this takes a while so I just cut it out. Stay on that same pipe where we put the battery in and jump off onto this ladder. We could just manually put this up, but that would be too much of a hassle for our heroes. Uh, these three, these 2D environments just, sometimes they're just so aggravating. Because you can't find out where to go. Now we have to jump onto this bar, but before we do that we're going to head up one more section and use our final battery. Because why not? We paid for three, so why not use three? So place the final battery here and get an ether. You could just jump down and get that, but uh, we're just going to climb up and not waste any time. So here's a bar here that we have to jump onto. You're going to press OK to jump onto it, and whenever you hear that noise, that noise, I'll press OK right after you hear it, and 
you should make it. And you'll climb up into the next section. And that's it for this video. In the next video, we will uh, target Shinra's headquarters. Good luck.